Hello everyone, are you ready for the new recipe? And this is going to be a dessert. It's a orange yogurt puffer. Yes, <laughs> puffer means a layer dessert served in a clear glass. So I'm going to try this new one. And it's, it came out very delicious. You guys also try it. It's a different one. And uh, it's a beautiful, uh, like it's a, a crunchy and smooth, um, sweety and of, uh, on that top of that there is an orange. Um, that also it gives a mixture of that. It's a beautiful thing. It's, it's a beautiful recipe. You, will, you are going to love this. So without any delay, let's start. For this, we need a layers, right? First layer is a, a biscuits, actually. So if you have a vegan homemade biscuit, you can try that or else uh, I'm going to make here one. See, half cup I have taken here uh, Java flour, yes, and a quarter cup is a pumpkin. You know, it's a raw pumpkin. I didn't cook it. I didn't steam, just a raw pumpkin. Um, do you have to grind that? It's a pulp. See, this is the raw pumpkin, right? Just cut into small pieces and grind it into smooth paste. So that paste I have taken here, quarter cup. So half cup is jar flour, quarter cup is uh, pumpkin uh, puree and uh, one tablespoon of uh, almond butter. It's a almond butter I have taken here. So you can take uh, any butter, peanut butter or any butter cashew butter or uh, coconut butter so in that spoon only i'm measuring a uh, one tablespoon of jaggery so if you want little more sweet you can add one more teaspoon of jaggery powder so mine was little uh, like bland it was not too sweet also so you can add one teaspoon extra jaggery powder so now quarter teaspoon of flex seeds so add that a uh, little bit only if you add more uh, that will come in uh, bites all bites that's why you can add only little if you so have now you have one, to mix that this also fine. Um, with spoon and later on you can knead the dough with hand so properly you have to knead uh, if you want a uh, little salt if you want you can add it will give you a better taste but I just don't prefer salt much so I'm just avoiding that if you okay with that you can add a little bit so just mix it and make a dough divide into part or you can roll it full if you have a big platform so I'm using here a parchment sheet if you have a better option you can do that or else you can dust it and um, properly you can uh, roll it with rolling pin and if you have a pressing machine, puppet pressing machine or chapati pressing machine, you can use that also. It will come very nicely with that. So and uh, cut it to pieces how shape you want, square or design, any design. See, basically we are making here crackers, harder one, not a smooth one. So we are just uh, making this as a thin, not uh, so thin, it's just thin not thick okay <laughs> and uh, just spread that in a uh, baking tray and bake this uh, approximately like for mine it took uh, for 17 minutes so um, heat also to uh, like uh, 220 or 30 and uh, in a preheated oven you can just keep that so as you can see here i'm keeping that in oven you can see here uh, this uh, heat and uh, function and the timing. I have kept 20 minutes but uh, I saw that um, so in 17 minutes itself it's done. So I just removed it. See, it's done. The crackers, you can eat it like that whenever you want. You can make this also. It's a very delicious cracker. If you want some more option like uh, herbs also you can add the, some jeera powder also you can add and uh, in the evening time you can have it the crackers like that itself. Why I didn't add to this jeera powder because uh, I'm making here sweet thing right I'm mixing this with a cream so I'm not adding jeera powder or if you want you can add 
and uh, eat it like that crackers okay let's make this uh, yogurt <laughs> right it's a beautiful uh, thing uh, just take a bowl and uh, add a i'm going to add a like a quarter cup of uh, plant based yogurt yogurt means it's a curd thick curd you you should take a thick curd means uh, take a plant based one okay not cow uh, cow curd it's cow yogurt so for that i'm going to use here uh, almond butter 1 tablespoon half a teaspoon of uh, lemon juice or you can put even orange also orange juice will be also nice if you want or else i'm just using here lemon juice and uh, see the taste if you required you can add some more also and uh, i'm adding here vanilla essence like a uh, 1/4 teaspoon of vanilla essence or else like you can go for 1/8 okay and uh, that's it uh, one more in ingredient is there that is jaggery jaggery i'm adding here uh, like a uh, 2 teaspoon okay and uh, you have to see the taste and then you add because some people like sweet more and some people likes less sweet uh, sweet so according to your sweet level you can increase that even the flavors also you can increase or decrease however you just taste it and uh, whichever you feel like you can add some more or skip it now you stir this without lumps or anything like if you want jaggery you can add it and taste it it's done very nice delicious creamy it's yogurt flavored yogurt you can eat it like that itself so now we are mixing all together to make orange yogurt <laughs> puffer okay so for that take a glass whatever you have transparent glass small i was having this big one so i am taking this add these biscuits down first in the base first uh, add these crackers break into pieces and add it and then add this cream on top of it here you can use any um, biscuits if you have in your home instead of uh, if you don't make these crackers for time being you can use that and yogurt is ready right and flavored yogurt is also there if you keep that in fridge that will also nice you can keep that uh, and uh, rem remove whenever it is serving time so just for that on this and uh, you can use any fruits to for toppings um i have used here um, orange it's a sweet one it's a nice sweety orange you can use even uh, blueberries strawberries and berries are uh, all you can use and uh, even um, you have to take the fruits like a citric one that will go well with this and that's it it's done right very nice even orange grapes kiwi all those things also it will come and uh, on top of it you can add lemon juice if you want uh, to decorate or i'm just using uh, any other uh, dry fruits you can use anything any topping you can add extra so that's it guys you have got this super delicious awesome snacks that looks like dessert right enjoy enjoy i enjoyed it you also enjoy making by making this it's very recipe is very very uh, easy right so whenever you want you just mix it and so one day you can make the yogurt and one day crackers and just mix it and have it right and you can serve this to your uh, friends or guests they will also like this it's a different um, variety of dessert and that's it guys it's done <laughs> enjoy this and thank you so much for liking my videos and sharing and watching my videos thank you so much and uh, let's see you in the next video okay until then namaste